Hey, Keenan. How you doing, sir? Good to see you. Big fan, man. Thank you, man. Big fan. Keenan Thompson, ladies and gentlemen. Keenan Thompson. It is 5.19 a.m. I have made it to Universal Orlando Resort for the opening day of Jurassic World's Velocicoaster. Welcome back to the channel and welcome if it's your first time. It's an exciting morning. It's an early morning out here so early. I've anticipated this moment for weeks now. I wanted to come to the opening day of Velocicoaster. I am so excited. Love roller coasters. This is going to be my experience today leading up to my first time ever riding the new coaster. I thought I'd take you guys with me. I hope you enjoy this video. I hope you enjoy this journey. The time now was 5.37. I could have came out here multiple times by now. There were some pass holder previews, but I wanted to come out here on opening day and experience the grand opening of this brand new attraction, be among the crowd and document everything going on today on opening day. Pass through the ticket gate at about 6.30. Sun is up as you can see on the outside of the parking garage. I am so excited guys. And as you can see the traffic is freed up. Most of everyone that was sitting in line out there is in line right here behind me. There are actually four lines going before the checkpoint. City Walk doesn't open for another 35 minutes. Face coverings are not required for fully vaccinated guests. Guests who are not fully vaccinated should wear face coverings while indoors. Made it through security, heading towards City Walk. And here we are, welcome to Universal Orlando Resort. 7.05 is the time, 7.05 walking towards Islands of Adventure. It does not open till 8. I'm sure there's going to be some kind of backup or line heading in. I'm sure all these people are here for Velocicoaster. Face mask no longer required for vaccinated guests. I'm vaccinated. The fountains are on this morning. Check it out. Warming up for the day. The Hard Rock Cafe. Across there. Heading this way, of course. I can see the tower. The Islands Tower, here we go. Welcome to the pack. Yeah, that's right, there's there's a pack right now. Head again to Islands of Adventure. Look at that, we're, we're moving fast. So they're channeling us, we're going all the way down this way, and coming back past the Hard Rock and the Chocolate Emporium. There's a lot of walking and a lot of people ahead of us. The Universal Studios Florida Globe right over there. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. The time now is 7.47. I was stopped in that spot for about a half hour. We are now moving in. They are opening up the park. The line goes all the way across the bridge here into City Walk. Comes this way, back down, and around. And here we go, almost 8 a.m. the park Opening up a little early, letting us in. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Islands of Adventure. And so the adventure begins. I'm inside the gates, and there's a bit of hustle inside the gates. Everyone rushing over to the Walasa Coaster area. This is, this is insane. Passing green eggs and ham, but there's no time for tater tots or any kind of breakfast. Everyone's hustling over. Right over there, folks, I can see it. Walasa Coaster as we're moving forward fast right over there 155 feet at its tallest point 70 miles per hour and we lost it beyond the brush hello big guy welcome to the lost continent good to see you hello happy coaster day all right hog speed no time for butterbeer Wish we could take that train all the way to the V coaster. And the line finally bottomed out right here in Hogsmeade. But I'm standing before the restrooms here. As I'm standing here, some AC blasts are coming out. That's nice. It's getting warm and toasty out here. A lot of people behind me. And we still have a couple hours until, oh wait, we're moving. We're moving already. That's good. So as things were unfolding this morning, there's a lot of rumors floating around the line in my vicinity. The Today Show is allegedly out here somewhere broadcasting their show for the grand opening. And also, the rumor is that we will not be able to ride the Lhasa Coaster until 10 a.m. We will see how true that is. 
Doesn't matter either way. I'm in line. I'm going to be near. Look, check it out. Hogwarts Castle, look at that. It's awesome. Either way, I'm riding this coaster today. I'm so excited to be here. Thank you for watching my experience. Look how lovely it looks in the morning. The sun hitting Hogwarts Castle there. We have a loss of coaster. It's moving. There it goes. Welcome to Jurassic Park. The time now is actually 7.59 and I am standing underneath the gates of Jurassic Park. Check it out. Getting closer. Over the hill and through the woods to the Velocicoaster we go. Oh no! And check it out, the dinosaur coming through the woods. Watch out, whoever's driving that Jeep. Moving past the Jurassic Park Discovery Center, there goes the Velocicoaster. We're getting there. And we're gonna curl down around Predatoria Pizza. I wish I could grab a slice, but they're not open. I can hear some raptors in there, some commotion out here beyond the wall. A little bit of track there. Maybe we'll get some coaster action come by. And here it comes. Yes! The sun bursting over the tracks as the coaster goes. And the line's going too. Moving again. This might go pretty quickly. Who's gonna win? Who's going to win that pizza? This battle's been going on for two decades. Someone has to win eventually. Funneling it this way, you can make part of Hogwarts Castle. Hey, what's up guys? Hey. And here we are passing the sign, Velocicoaster, wait time, opens at 9 o'clock, okay, so someone said 10, and it's 9. Oh, there you go, hot set, today show, in production today. Oh, look at these guys, Velociraptors to my left and to my right, and the coaster right above me, look at that, look at the track. And look, we're walking past the today show, look at that. That's amazing. That is amazing. Are we on TV? Okay, they're, they're telling us to keep going. That was awesome though. Whoa! Velocicoaster straight ahead. I love what they've done with the place. Here it comes, right past us, making that drop. There it goes. Oh, wow. And the Jurassic Park sign over here on the backside of the Discovery Center. It's the first time I've seen this area with these own eyes, <laughs> of course. Hey, man. Vincent Vision in the house. What's up, dude? Uh, what's up, man? You've ridden this thing, right? I have. I have. You've not ridden this. No, it's my first time. Oh I, I wanted gosh. to wait for opening day. Okay. Then yeah. it's a little bit more special, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right, man. Well, you get in there. I well, I want to see if they're going to film something. They're doing the Today Show back there. I feel like I want to hang out for that. Yeah. Well, well check that out, man. All right, well, good luck in there, have fun. There it goes, oh my lordy. There it went. Here we go. This is a high speed roller coaster that includes sudden dramatic acceleration, climbing, tilting, inversions, and dropping. They're funneling us in fast. It's hard to read everything. A week ago, I was in Greenfield, Indiana when I was back home visiting my mom for her birthday. I passed through Greenfield and I passed the old theater in the downtown. And that's where I watched Jurassic Park, and I was sitting there across from the theater, which has recently been restored, thinking about the time, the first time I saw Jurassic Park that night with my family. And those same emotions are kind of coming back to me right now. I'm about to ride this coaster. I've been waiting for this day for so long. I tried my hardest, and I succeeded of not getting any spoilers, not watching any videos of Velocicoaster. No offense to my friends, they're awesome YouTubers. They did several videos of Velocicoaster already. But I wanted to experience this. I wanted to experience it 110%. You get what I'm saying? I wanted to experience that today. No spoilers going into this attraction. I'm glad I got here so early. There are so many people behind me, thousands of people. Just a couple hundred in front of me, heading our way further into the queue. Check out these big fans here. Man, they feel so nice. Look at that. It's like a helicopter blade there. And we've got raptors ahead. I'm aiming up to the ceiling so you can see the lighting in here. Look at that. About to get a whole lot closer to those pack of raptors. Well, check it out. Boom, dinosaur DNA. Little 
promo going over there, a little tutorial. Looks like eventually we'll be going through those doors over there, past the Raptors, funneling back this way. About to turn 9 a.m. That is epic. Look at these sculptures, these Raptor sculptures, amazing. One, two, three, four of them. Look at that. It's awesome. A little closer look there for you. Amazing. And there's their feet and the raptor claws. And over there on the wall, the logo, the insignia. Right there, the classic insignia. All right, moving into another room here or into another hallway. Some posters on the wall. We got blue and echo, delta, and Charlie, the four velociraptors right there. It's getting darker in here. That is so cool. Blue is first, of course. Blue is first. And look at this hallway. Whoa, there goes the coaster. Oh, and a raptor right behind it. That's awesome. Oh, I think that was Delta. Oh no, maybe, maybe that was Charlie. This is so awesome. Look at this. Oh, Boom, dinosaur DNA. Scan your ticket at an available station. Oh, it's telling us how to work the lockers. You won't be returned. I just scanned my ticket. You remember that number. We remember the uh, dinosaur and we retrieve our stuff after the coaster, of course. What is this? Look at this from Jurassic World. Look, it's Dr. Malcolm's book. That's cool. This is so immersive, guys. I feel like I'm inside a raptor's den here. Oh, there's some weapons up there. Look at the weapons. And over here, oh, some of the raptors right there. That is amazing. Oh my gosh. Look how real that is. The Lhasa Coaster is an innovative roller coaster, and its unique design allows you to achieve top speeds for the ultimate raptor close encounter. It includes sudden and dramatic acceleration, climbing, tilting, inversions, and dropping. Okay, so because they're filming the Today Show outside... So because they're filming the Today Show outside, there's a brief delay in operation, and they just told us that over the intercom. So I'm just... I'm stuck in a cool spot there. All right, so he's over there. I'm right in front of this bracket here. Here's a closer look of what the Velociraptors are actually contained in. As you see in Jurassic World, this is the mechanism. This is so cool. This one's empty. That one? Almost empty if you keep shaking like that. Okay, so the next room appears to be the lockers. So I will be checking in my hat, my glasses, my phone, my keys, my wallet, my camera. I will be checking all that in so I can ride the coaster. It is locker time. I've got my card ready. Eight through five locker banks. Hello. What's going on? The lockers are right around the corner. There's so many lockers here. This is a giant room. We're going, there's six. Eight, here we go. Okay, it is time to put you guys up. We just scan a locker here. Oh, and it pops open right there, bottom. All right, guys, I'm pinning you away. I'll see you right after. Actually, I'll pick you up on the other side of the locker. That's where you pick up your stuff on the other side of the ride. All right, I'll see you soon. How about some roller coaster footage while I ride it, though? Some Velocicoaster. All right, see ya. Bye-bye. Took off the hat, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. I just rode it. Yeah! Oh, my gosh. The churro stand's officially open. Free churros? This is awesome. For, oh, for the Today Show? Churro! Churro, free churros. That was amazing. A little inside joke. There is a churro stand actually at Velocicoaster. A free, a free churro stand. 
They're handing out free churros there as I came off that remarkable, amazing experience. What a roller coaster that was. Oh my gosh, so intense. Oh, it looks like we're exiting through the Discovery Center. Whoa, look at that, Brad. All right, they have us exiting through the Discovery Center. Fun fact, these dinosaurs you see hanging here are the original diners, dinosaur from Jurassic Park. Those were at the end of the original movie. Just in case you didn't know. Must go faster. That's awesome. I like that t-shirt there. And there I was, front row left. No hat, hands up, enjoying the awesomeness of that roller coaster. That was amazing. So the line actually went pretty quick and I would have walked right on, except for the fact that the Today Show was filming out here and they kept pausing the coaster for a period, two periods of about 25 minutes. I waited an extra about 40, 40 to 50 minutes for the ride. And I also opted for the front row. There was a standby line, I got to the right. I would have ridden it right away, but I waited for that line. So there you go. When you come, there is a standby line for the first row, and that's what I did. And also, you're probably not gonna deal with the Today Show. This line here is going to be all day long. I'm glad I got here early. I really, I'm really enjoying today. Oh my gosh, I've got goosebumps. I waited for this day for so long and I, I just couldn't wait to get here and ride that. And it is amazing. It is now one of my favorite roller coasters. I have to ride it a few more times to, uh, to put the verdict out officially, but oh my gosh. The Raptors along the tracks, were awesome it was like they were jumping out at you the rocks like I felt like I was going through uh, mountains it was like it was like I was in Jurassic Park Jurassic World it was amazing and the parts where you go over the water like I felt like I was diving down into the sea and all of a sudden I just you just twist and you're coming up out of the sea I mean it's amazing like I, I don't know I've never I've never ridden a roller coaster where I felt like I was gonna fall out but I felt safe at the same time if that makes sense that was cool, I love that feeling. But yeah, strongly recommend this one. Jurassic World, everyone's loving it so far. The morale around here, the crowd, the, the roar of the Raptor crowd is amazing. When we were in the queue, everyone was just cheering, everyone coming on and off the coaster. Everyone's having a good time in here. I'm happy to be here on the opening day of Velocicoaster with you guys. I, I hope you're enjoying my experience today. Thank you so much. You're gonna love it, I just know it. You're gonna love it. I'm like standing over here, they're bringing, bringing the cart out. <laughs> and I'm still finishing my churro. Just a long-winded shot. Oh yeah. So it is now 10.15. I just got word that it is now a three hour wait to ride VelociCoaster. So good thing I got here early. Hey Keenan, how you doing sir? Good to see you. Big fan, man. Thank you, Big fan. Keenan Thompson, ladies and gentlemen. Keenan Thompson. And here we go. We can get a sneak peek over here through these bars into the Velociraptor containment area. There it is. Oh, wow. Oh, and here they come around the bed. Oh, yeah. Checking it out at all angles possible today. There it goes. Checking out all angles of the perimeter of Jurassic World. I'm standing next to the River Adventure. Looks like it's a 40 minute wait for the Jurassic Park boat ride. Three hour wait currently for Velocicoaster. So exciting out here. Very exciting. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh man, I didn't get wet. I was hoping for some a little bit of moisture, didn't get any at all. It's hot out here. That was fun. And the T-Rex has returned. They've got a T-Rex. Oh yes, they do. Popping out of the brush there. This was here last time I was here, but on the other side of Jurassic Park, the old Explorer there. But yeah, the classic T-Rex. Oh yes, they've got a T-Rex. So I'm passing me ship the olive. Ga, 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 ga. I love Popeye. I'm heading out to the viewing area to get a better look at Velocicoaster, the best place to take, to take photos with the Velocicoaster, actually. Great spot out here. 
Here they go, 155 feet to the top. That drop was amazing, almost 90 degrees shooting out that way. And this is the point right after the big drop. You shoot out towards Hogwarts and you come back. And look how close you get to the water here. I could almost touch it. Hold on, wait for it. They're coming back around. Here it comes. Look how close they get to the water here. Whoa, pretty close. And this is really the last stretch of the ride. You actually go right up inside there to the end of the ride. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, do me a favor. Give it one of those right down there. A like right down there below the video. I appreciate that. It was a quick one today. I just wanted to document my experience. I had a wonderful time. Thank you for joining me for it. I hope you had a good time watching. I hope you're able to get out here and ride Velocicoaster yourself. It is so worth it. Amazing stuff. A thrill ride. I can't, I can't wait to come back and ride that again. However, there might be a longer wait next time. If you come early, you have a better chance right now. There is no digital cues. If you come early, get here at the crack of dawn, you have a better chance and hurry up over towards Velocicoaster. You'll get right on, hopefully. That is your that is your best chance. Again, thanks for watching. I am Tampa J. If it was your first time here, come on back, subscribe below. There's a subscribe button below. Check out some more of my videos. I do a lot of theme parks, filming locations, off the beaten path, roadside attractions. And I'm disclosing this because it might be your first time or I may have never, I never really talk about what goes on this channel at the end of the videos. I just kind of, I just kind of end them. Maybe it's good that I, uh, I throw it out there more. I don't know. But thank you so much. This is a long-winded goodbye. I hate goodbyes, but this video is over. Know you're awesome. Know you're loved. Didn't know there's much ahead. Shout out to Keenan Thompson. Awesome seeing him today. So awesome. See you guys. And there she goes one more time.